And we here, we have such a special guest. We have the great up and coming Shakur Stevenson. Shakur, how you doing, brother? I'm good. I'm just chilling, you know, uh, getting ready for this next fight. Who you fighting? It's an African guy's name, uh, Jeremiah Nakatilli. Yeah. Do you have any films of him? What's his record? Uh, I think he like 21 and 1. Oh, 21 and 1. Yeah, okay. I ain't really watching. And so how, how's been, how's uh, training camp been going, Shakur? I mean, right now. So you in camp right now? Time? I mean, I'm getting to camp. Like, uh, I, I'm always in the gym, so I'm never really like out of shape. But next week, I'm going to go to Colorado Springs. And I'm oh, that's my, the bomb. I'm my camp with uh, Terrence Crawford. I used to train up there. That was the bomb. Yeah, it's the altitude. Uh, yeah, that's where uh, all my training camps was at when I was getting ready for the Olympics. Yeah, so you guys pretty much live out there, right? For a, yeah. Yeah. a whole year, right? In the springs? Yeah, most definitely. Uh, I'm going to do eight weeks down there for this camp. Then whenever my next fight comes, I'm going to be back down there for another eight weeks. So. so you're not a guy that goes to Big Bear? You prefer Colorado Springs? I, know, I like Colorado Springs. Me I like the, the altitude there. Yeah. And I'm used to it. Well, Big Bear too, right? Big Bear is about the same. Uh... Colorado Springs is more sociable than Big Bear is more isolated. Yeah. You, know you, you prefer you prefer Big Bear or Colorado Springs? I, I'm Colorado Springs. It's more professional there. Yeah. And Colorado Springs is just a little hick town. Going down the south, I'm gonna have myself a time. Friendly faces everywhere. Humble folks without temptation. Cabins in it, you know? This the brother right here? Yeah, that's him. Yeah. All right. Nambia. All right, let's check him out. Let's see his moves. Uh, he's, he looks kind of tall. Is he tall? Yeah, he's like uh, 5'10", I think. And you 5'8", right? Yeah. I don't think that mattered too much, though. Nah, it's all about the diet, how yeah. bad you want it. So who's this gentleman? Did you ever hear of him? You know his name? Nah, I don't even know him. i never even seen this fight. Oh, look at this. You, 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 don't, like to, you don't like to study film? I study some film, but I, I kind of do it with my grandfather. Me and my grandfather watch it together. Yeah. Hey, listen, right? If this guy lays a glove on you, you should retire. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! No, but you know what, Mike? You go back to what you said. Never under it takes. It takes one blow, one. Nah, hit, no, you, you know? do your thing, baby. You yeah. Go, oh, man. yeah, he right. <laughs> that guy couldn't hit you if you were blindfolded. Yeah, you right about that. <laughs> and he's tough too, though. If you come to fight him, he's tough. Yeah. Who would you like to fight after this, Shakur? I really Be want the real. Valdez fight. Like, the like Valdez, Valdez fight is something that I'm really looking forward to. I wanted to fight him at 126, but he ended up vacating his belt and moving up. So, I, I've, I've watched Valdez a lot, man. What, what do you, what, how, how would you rank his power? I think uh, he got a lot of power. I think he threw a lot of uh, hard shots, but I think that uh, later in the rounds, he gassed out. Let's check Valdez out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have have you seen a Valdez uh, fight before? I hear his name out there. Yeah, Oscar Valdez. He's a I real hear his good. Name he's, uh, out there. He he went through the amateurs too. I think he went to the Olympics too for Mexico. You fight him in the amateurs? Nah, I ain't never fight him in the amateurs. He went to uh, then he went to two Olympics. He went to a couple Olympics. Yeah, he's experienced, huh? Yeah, yeah. he's from uh, he's from northern Mexico in Sonora. Sonora, that's where the frog comes from. Yeah. He's scared to fight me though, man. You think so? Yeah, you know, know what? Sh show his last uh, uh, knockout. I think it's this fight, but yeah, the this knockout fight. in this fight. So That's him right there? Yeah. It's two different styles, you know? Both him and uh, Shakur, they have two different styles. So it's, you know, styles kind of make fights or, you know? Yeah. Depends who, who brings their A game. I promise you, I'm bringing my A game. Oh, that's him? See, these guys, do that's him right here to the open punch like that? Yeah. So you you can see these punches come a mile away, away. though, right? Yeah. Yep. Cause I can see punches like that while I was fighting come a mile away. They're hard, but you can they're like slow motion. What round is this? This guy he's, doesn't move his head. He's power like that. Yeah, he's just standing right in front of him. He ain't moving his head. Ooh. Coming straight forward. The yeah. move is come straight forward. And got clock. Look, head head in the air. Boom. Yep. Me and my man right here, we're technicians, man. <laughs> you miss, you gonna pay with your life, man. Yep. Look at that. Boom, head in the head, hands out here, not guarding himself. Yep. Look at him, look at him. That's an amateur fighting. Boom. You gotta touch his body too, though. 
Yeah, that body's vicious. Yeah. Guys can take it to the jaw, but you hit them to the body. Yeah. Hey, what you doing down there, yeah, right? <laughs> what, what are you doing down there? <laughs> what makes Oscar Valdez a good boxer? I think he got a lot of will. I think like uh, really aggressive, yeah. Yeah, he, he got a lot of will. I don't think he really skill fitty that good, but <laughs> it's dangerous though when you got somebody that's like that got both, like somebody that yeah. got the heart and got the skill. So yeah. it's hard to beat them. Yeah. What What's your take right now with everything that's going on with uh, with the thirty five division with uh, Teofimo? You Ryan gotta Garcia. touch some of that. Yeah, I, I can't wait till like I'm near and I'm at that division to like be in them big fights with them. But uh, I think that is a great division. I think it's a lot of great fighters there. Uh, I got respect for a lot of them fighters. So. But I feel like like the people in my like division, I've been trying to like fight the champs, and I feel like none of them want to fight. Like who's the champs? Right now, uh, like I said, Valdez was a champ at twenty six. When I when I became his mandatory, he vacated the belt and moved up. Okay. Now Jamel Heron, he just fought for the belt. He won, and now I'm his I mandatory. I thought he was one hundred and forty one. This nah, he's one thirty. Yeah, okay. I'm his mandatory, and he uh, now he's gonna vacate the belt and try to fight Valdez. Man, you're a scary guy. I don't know. Oh. Look at who, that, man. Who are oh. some of the guys you've uh, you've emulated that you've taken from? Probably like uh, Pinnell Whitaker, um, Sugar oh. Ray Leonard. Sugar Ray. I see a lot of Pinnell. You look good, though, son. Oh. <laughs> uh, I, I watch Terrence Crawford a lot, too. I like yeah. Terrence. Yeah. How difficult is, is it the way uh, Terrence Crawford is like he's able to switch to both stands? How how difficult is that, man? Because he's been he's been able to master, and I think that's what makes him, in my eyes, pound for pound, is the fact that he able he his right and his left are are both Damn. vicious, man. I think Terrence just like he a dog, and like it's gonna be hard for anybody to beat Terrence Crawford. That's all I'm gonna say. Anybody, I don't care who it is. All right, so you got Terrence Crawford over anybody. Who else do you got out there? <laughs> <laughs> look how beautiful you look. You're just laying these guys out. Ooh, fast hands. Yeah. Look how he bend his legs. Can't hit him. Punch. Ooh, and then move. He see he moves his head right after he punch. Just in case the guy come back and get mm -hmm. countered. Would you like would you like a matchup with uh Ooh, with Vasily Lomachenko? Baby. Yeah, I would love to fight. Uh, I think you should as well. You should. I sparred him um, to to uh, get him ready for Uh huh. Yeah, I sparred him. We did probably like uh, a lot. Of, we did a lot of rounds in camp. Yeah, yeah. What you think? You, you you like that matchup with you and him? Yeah, I would love to fight Lomachenko. I think that's a that would be that'd be a great fight. Yeah, I think he's too small for thirty five. I think he should come down to uh, one thirty. I think so too. Yeah, probably. You've uh, you've got you sparred with Tank before too. Yeah, I, I, I hope Tank get ready for uh his world title fight with Pedraza. How you like Danny uh, Haley? He did the show. Who? Haley, uh, fuck Haney, I mean. Oh, yeah, uh, Devin, Devin Nice, too. Yeah. I think he a real good fight. I think he real skillful. How you think him and Tifo do? I think that's a good fight. I think that uh, Devin Haney more skillful, but uh, Tia Fimo got the, um, the better power. Yeah. It's an entertainment business, so you got to be entertaining. Big time, big time. <laughs> and the sooner they know it, the most money they get. Yep. I was crazy. I was talking about people, mothers eating their kids. Everybody came to see that shit. Yeah. <laughs> How old are you? Twenty one. I'm twenty three. Twenty three. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool, man. Are you watching that Canelo Billy Joe Saunders fight? What do, what do you think? You think people are sleeping on Billy Joe Saunders? Yeah, I think that Billy Joe Saunders is a better fighter than people give him. Let's look at Billy fight. Joe Saunders' ass now. <laughs> Let's look at Billy Joe. Sanders. But I don't. I don't think he could be Canelo. 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 Oh, now he's not. He's, he's better than people think, but he nah, can't he is. be Canelo. It's, Come on. But it's Canelo Alvarez, man. Like it's yeah, hard. To have you him. seen? Have you seen David Benavides? Have you seen David Benavides, Mike? Yeah. Tall guy, right? Yeah. I he's like a, him too. Dude, he's a real deal, Mike. Yeah, he a beast. He remind me of um, Carlos Monzon a little bit. Man. What the hell has happened? Dude, Damn, man. he really clocked that guy. <laughs> Throw the towel <laughs> in that <laughs> motherfucker. Nah, he a beast though. Him he's and Cholo. That's Cholo. A yeah, Charlo, nice. Yeah, you gotta get in there with him, see how nice he is. Yeah. Actually, I wanna see him fight uh Caleb Plant. Uh he will be plant, man. You think he'll be yeah. Caleb, Caleb Plant good. Yeah, but this this dude's got everything. You know what you talking about? We're talking about will and skill. But Caleb Plant could box real good too. And he got power. <sighs> I think I think the speed and the length is, is gonna be the difference. 
in that fight. And I think that's why I would give it to Benavides. Yeah, it'd be a good fight, though. So tell I, think, me, I think Benavides is the only one that could beat Canelo. Honest, I swear. You think really? he could beat Canelo? I think he's the only one that could beat him. Oh. Let's do it now, baby. Let's get that fight going. Canelo Alvarez? Canelo Alvarez, yeah. yeah. Dude, this dude's the youngest, uh, what is it, the youngest, the, the super middleweight? Is that 168? Yeah. The youngest in history to win a world title, dude. In yeah, history. he was. You then you went to like what uh 17 or yeah like something crazy dude you know what i'm saying you start you break records like that you doubt a dude like this that's that's crazy man wilfredo benitez the youngest champ ever 17. yeah and he was nice movement yeah. <laughs> yeah, he was nice yeah. <laughs> he was real good what's your take with uh what's your take with ryan garcia man Do, is he the, is, is ryan garcia the real deal man or is it a lot of your guy social should media go at hype? It, baby oh this guy's think... going for it I think Ryan Garcia is a uh, he another one who's better than what what people give him. Like a lot of people think I that think he's, he's just good, a YouTube good sensation. Puncher. Yeah, but he's a real good puncher. All I think all I think he need to like get his chin out the air. Yeah, too high. Yeah, it's always it's always high. Ooh, look at that motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. What do you think of the Pacquiao Mayweather fight? I mean the Pacquiao Crawford fight. Crawford gonna stop him. Gonna you stop Pacquiao? Yeah. I don't think so. You don't think so? Nah, nigga, let's bet for soda or some shit. I'm with it. I'll bet whatever. <laughs> Mike, you're a big you're a big Pacquiao fan now, Mike. Yeah, so am I. I think Pacquiao's so one of the greatest. So do you think Pacquiao's gonna win? Fuck yeah. Oh. I'm gonna say Shakur. I told that young nigga Shakur that he was gonna do that shit. <laughs> yeah. what, what, do you, what do you think of you two boxing? Whew. I mean, I got like a uh, it's like a love hate like I. It's entertaining and all, but like I don't see it like it's like real fighting. Like I'm a real boxing fan, so I would like I like watching Errol Spence and Terence Crawford and yeah. But dudes. that's the thing, man. They gotta fight, man. A lot yeah. of that stuff. That's why that stuff is good because the real motherfuckers don't want to fight each other. Except with uh, with the Andre Ward, man. He's also uh, he's also your manager, right? Who's nah, your manager? He, he was my manager. My manager, Jay Prince. Jay Prince. Yeah, yeah. But uh, Andre Ward, he a great fighter, and uh, he, I think he one of the best fighters to ever do it. Yeah. Uh, I just don't think he got the credit for it. Cause he was a nice guy and didn't talk shit and yeah. stuff. Yeah, what I talk a whole bunch of shit. People still going, "Hey, is that true?" <laughs> I don't know, man. It's talking shit, you know, it's talking you, shit. You like that fight, Mike? If if uh, if he if uh, Andre Ward comes back for Canelo and he fights him, I would love that. That's beautiful, right? But it should be at sixty-eight. Could uh, Ward make sixty-eight? He made seventy-five, but sixty-eight is beautiful. Yeah. Four seventy five, man. I mean, it, it, it could also be Canelo trying to make it. Yeah, 68. but Canelo can't beat Andre Wood. All right, look. hey, you hear that, Canelo? He said you could beat everybody it. else but this brother Andre Wood. Yep, I said it. Like, and I'm that, a big Canelo like fan. That. I love Canelo, but all right, I want to see it happen. Come on, Wood. What's that? What's that? Twenty million Wood. Big time lines. opponent. Some guys are the greatest fighters in the world, but they ain't exciting. Yeah, they could beat anybody. Yes, they don't do it looking good. I think you're gonna be very successful. Yeah, thank you. I think you'll be very successful. Yeah, that means a lot coming from you. Nah, you know, you, how many amateur fights you have? Like 200, see, 200 something. See, that's 200 fights. Now, you think that count for what he's doing this so good? <laughs> 200 times. Yeah. I personally think that the amateurs is, is harder than the actually professional. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. I agree. Can you that. listen? You fight the like the first night you fight the best fighter in the world. The next night you fight the number two best fighter in the world. <laughs> yeah. You never get an easy fight. You perfect. You get ten, twenty easy fights before you get a, a good opponent. You yeah. know. Yeah. Huh? When I go in the ring, I ain't going in there thinking like, you feel me? Like, okay, we gonna give him my all, and if we lose, no, 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 I want to be up more than anybody in the fucking world want me to be down. No one can stop me. I'm invincible. Look at my show, my $300 million worth of shit. Now you're on my show. <laughs> you're hosting my show with me. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, what's up, man? Yeah. What the fuck's going on with you? You got 10 there. brothers and sisters? I got it's eight brothers and sisters. Eight brothers and I'm, sisters. I'm nine. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. When you got eight brothers and sisters, motherfucker can't be taking too much of the pie. Yeah, right. 
how would you like to uh, end your career, man? Like, what would be the the, ch the cherry on top for you, man, if you could? I want to be a pay-per-view superstar. I want to be a uh, several division world champ. Um, I want to be undisputed a few times in several different weight classes. But I just want to be like a big superstar. Like, I want the whole world to know, like, like how Mike Tyson is like a legend. Like I want to be a legend. Like the world to know that I'm a legend. Don't be a legend with no fucking money. Like that, <laughs> nah, I'm gonna make sure I, I no, stay. No, no, they all said <laughs> but... that. All of us said that. Right, but I'm gonna say that. Don't be a legend like that. Like you a legend to me. Like I respect yeah, you a real. lot. Like and you a cancer. Like you a cancer. Oh, I'm yeah, a cancer. You're a sensitive yeah. motherfucker, man. <laughs> Stop. Don't be giving all your money to the fucking girls, man. All right, stop. Stop giving your money to those girls. Give it to your family. Yeah, I got Leave you. Leave those fucking girls alone, man. Stop, okay? Stop. <laughs> nah, but I definitely, I looked up to Mike, like, my whole upbringing. And I used to, like, watch his interviews and listen to, like, the stuff he say, and I'd be like, I laugh. you crazy, right? <laughs> <laughs> I, that's, 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 this should drive you crazy. You know, watch, watch. You gonna be crazy in a minute. <laughs> You watch, watch. <laughs> Listen, he ain't got a girl yet. He ain't got a girl. Nah, I got a girl. I got Not, a girl. Oh, do you love her? I love her. What's her name? Lyric. Say it right here. A lyric. That's her name? Say, <laughs> say, 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 I love you with all my heart. And I would die Bay, I you. love you, Lyric. This dude is crazy. Who, no, I'm telling you the truth, little man. Like, watch out. Be careful. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> Talking about me, watch him in a couple of years when he's the superstar he wants to be. And what's her name again? Lyric. Okay. <laughs> Remember that. I'ma still be with her too. I know you are. Mm -hmm. At least you gonna be with you. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> we always stick with them, even when they leave us, but she gonna be with you. No, she gonna be with me. <laughs> Lily gonna be laughing at this shit. <laughs> yeah, you know, why, you gonna, why are you gonna sit with that wild crazy man? <laughs> You're not supposed to be saying the things you say. <laughs> It is oh, crazy, man. Man, well, that's what's up, man. Well, it's, it's been an honor, man. It's been an yeah, honor to have you on the Appreciate y'all, too. Man. Really, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, a little, I'm a little high talking And shit. I'm your yeah, co-host, <laughs> a.k.a. Triple C, Henry Cejudo. I'm Mike Tyson. We got, we got the great Shakur Stevenson. Thank you for your presence, brother. Yeah, appreciate y'all, too. Um, I don't know, man. Yeah, yeah, Lennox Lewis. Lennox, I'm coming for you. Mike, is it frustrating to train like you did and then have no, this in seven I didn't or eight train seconds? For this fight. I only trained probably two weeks or three weeks for this fight. I had to bury my best friend and I dedicated this fight. I wasn't going to fight. I dedicated this fight to him. I was going to rip his heart out. I'm the best ever. I'm the most brutal and vicious and most ruthless champion there's ever been. There's no one can stop me. Lynx is a conqueror. No, I'm Alexander. He's no Alexander. I'm the best ever. There's never that's been anybody as ruthless. I'm Sonny Liston. I'm Jack Dempsey. There's no one like me. I'm from their claw. There's no one that can match me. My style is impetuous. My defense is impregnable. And I'm just ferocious. I want your heart. I want to eat his children. Praise be to Allah. Are you saying now, Mike, that Mike, 